Hello to everybody out there. Oh, moin moin, like we say here in Flensburg, uh, my hometown, uh, a small town at the shores of the Baltics, right here up in northern Germany. Well, it's Sunday, a cloudy, rainy, windy, cool, dark Sunday. It's early afternoon. So, uh, the best thing to make a video and talk to you guys. Uh, first, I smoke one of my Zuring pipes with the Cumberland stem, a very s small stem, a very light pipe. Uh, the number is 965, which means uh, from the 1,400 pipes Mr. Zuring built, this is a number six, 965. Uh, I smoke Da Vinci, by, made by Dunpipe, a uh, Virginia and Black Cavendish flavored with... Uh, red wine but just a little bit it's not too sweet not too aromatic uh, especially for a smoker like me uh, who prefers nature tabac this is a good tobacco for smoking on a on an afternoon like uh, now uh, with it i have a shandy it's half beer half lemonade also a little bit sweet uh, I couldn't drink it in the evening. It's just for this afternoon. It's a good drink. Because uh, I had already coffee enough this morning. Yeah, my wife and me, we came back uh, this week, Wednesday, from a 14-day trip to Ireland. We had a real great time. This country is beautiful. I met a lot of Americans there in the hotels or some places we have been. Most of them, they came to uh, visit the country of their ancestors. Uh, we seen towns like Donegal, Galway, Limerick, Kilkenny. Um, fantastic. We also uh, traveled to Northern Ireland, visit the town of Londonderry, like the British say or Derry, like the Irish say. Uh, traveled down the west coast with all their cliffs and rocks and palm trees and beaches. Uh, yeah, so many times in the evening, so what shall we do in Ireland? We uh, went to some pubs, talked to nice people and um, listened to the music they play there. Uh, had a lot of beer, of course. So, we really enjoyed the time there and uh, it was fantastic. Well, uh, in Dublin, we made the uh, typical to a tourist uh, make. We seen the Trinity College, the castle and church and the bridges. And we sit at the River Liffey and uh, in a cafe and had coffee and we did all these tourist things uh, tourists do in Dublin. But they have one place a pipe smoker has to go, and that is a Peterson shop. At the end of the video, I will show you about a minute or so, uh, one and a half minute, a little video I made with my pet uh, in the Peterson shop, so you can see a little bit how it looks like. It's a dream for, for a pipe smoker. Uh, because they have all the pipes they have in stock they have there and uh, I came in and pointed at a pipe and said I like to have this pipe and the guy behind the counter said that's the most expensive pipe we have they want to have 670 euro for it so forget it uh, I paid this amount of money for our rented car for two weeks you know so no pipe in this uh, class but I bought two fantastic pipes and uh, I want to show you 
here, the first one I bought. There's a typical green bag Peterson has. And there it is. Wait, oops, 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 oops. This pipe has no shape number. It's uh, one pipe of a Serie uh, Peterson make. This uh, pipe is from the uh, uh, Serie called Iceberg Collection. This Iceberg Collection has four shapes, and uh, they one shape is called uh, stern, bow, port and starboard. This here is a starboard shape. Got a lot of wood. It's pretty uh, big for, for a lot of tobacco. And the fine thing is, I don't know if you, you can see it, they have engraved the Titanic I saw this pipe and I said I must have it and now I have it. Then I, I said oh I would like to have a real classical uh, old type pipe but not the banded one. I have a banded pipe from uh, Peterson. So I looked at this one and I bought this pipe. This is not a Cumberland stem, it's acrylic, but uh, looks like Cumberland. A real classical pipe. It has a shape number 606. This pipe called Irish Harp, they engraved in the ring don't know if you see it a little harp lightweight I smoked it a few times real good smoker I like it and my wife says it fits good to my face I hope she is right well um, this was uh, the last two days in Dublin and uh, before we flew back and I had my two new pipes so I was was happy now I'm talking about another pipe I, I got I got just one day before I left Germany uh, for our journey uh, the story is Glenn pipe nutter he has seen yeah in my I think in one of my first videos my uh, pipe of the year 213 from Faun. Mm, I liked it when I, I get it, but uh, it was for me, it was too skinny, and uh, uh, I never real loved this pipe. I don't know why, but Glenn said it. He liked this pipe and he want to have it, so uh, we decided to trade. And he asked me what kind of pipes I like, and I said, I. I love this American style poker, this short uh, pipes with this uh, colorful stem and uh, real heavy, or not heavy, big, large pipes. Uh, and uh, they are not uh, used here in Germany, but I see them always in uh, on your American uh, uh, videos and I said I would like to have one of those and he said okay he will see what he can do so I sent him to, to some tobacco and I sent him this found pipe and uh, a day before I left Germany a little parcel was arriving it was from Rick Black in the US and in this little parcel was a Rick Black pipe. Uh, Glenn uh, managed uh, that Rick sent me this pipe and I was so surprised about this beauty and I was so happy 
And uh, I took it with me to Ireland and smoked it there a few times. And uh, I'm so satisfied. It, it's a great and fantastic thing. I show you now. I got something in the hand. There's a lot of tobacco in. I don't know what to say. This is just a beauty. And uh, I think this will not be uh, the last one I have. I think I get in contact with, uh, with Rick Black and sometime and going to buy another one. I like it. Yeah, I don't have uh, much more to tell. I just uh, will uh, enjoy the the uh, Sunday afternoon here at home. Cannot go out. It's rainy, rainy, rainy. I would like to go out with a motorcycle, but the last three days I had no chance because uh, I have a motorcycle and not a submarine. Uh, so I stay here. Maybe later on drinking a beer, but I will smoke a few pipes. And uh, so I just say, enjoy your time. Enjoy the rest of the Sunday you have. Stay well. Take care. I see you guys. Bye. This is the Pfeifenraucher's Traum. The Peterson Laden in the Nassau Street in Dublin. Ich will mal reingehen und mal gucken, ob es mir erlaubt ist, innen drin ein paar Aufnahmen zu machen. Ich gehe mal rein. So Leute, jetzt gehe ich rein. Das ist der Traum eines jeden Pfeifenrauchers, Leute. Peterson, Peterson Shop in Dublin. Der Traum eines jeden Rauchers. Ich habe gestern hier zwei wunderschöne Pfeifen erstanden, die ich euch nachher auch noch vorstellen werde. Ich mache natürlich kurz, ich möchte die Leute hier auch nicht länger als nötig stören. Tabak kaufen hat keinen Sinn, der ist doppelt so teuer wie in Deutschland. Und aus dieser Serie habe ich mir ein wunderschönes Pfeifchen gekauft. Die zeige ich euch gleich. And that's a nice guy who sold me the pipe yesterday. Two pipes. Yeah. But only two. I was not allowed to buy more. So, ich muss leider wieder gehen. Thank you very much. Goodbye.